family. He's a family man. He, yes. he didn't bother yeah. anyone. He's a father, grandfather, and a husband of 23 years. He was killed senselessly. Now Kenneth Hamilton is a homicide victim. He was minding his own business. Yeah, it hurts. After he was shot and killed in Dallas this weekend. And a car pulled up and just shot him. Just randomly, just shot him for no reason. His wife Joyce and sister Karen said Saturday night, Kenneth was just driving home when he pulled up to this intersection at Beckley and Clarendon and was shot by someone in this black Tahoe. Surveillance video shows the suspect pull up, stop, and drive away. Innocent people are being killed for no reason at all. But the Dallas Police Department believes that black Tahoe may be linked to more than one shooting. Police say that black Tahoe is the suspect vehicle in another Saturday night homicide on Empire Central. And a black Tahoe is also the suspect vehicle in a shooting that injured a different driver on East Grand early Monday. So at this point, do you believe that the driver of that black Tahoe or at least a passenger in that vehicle is shooting random people in the city of Dallas unprovoked? We have not established that it was random at this time, uh, uh, nor have we established that they're the, the actual connection. You know, he was just out and about. What we do know is the Hamilton family is grieving. There needs to be a change mm -hmm. in the community. After a father, grandfather, and husband never made it home Saturday night. I don't care where you go. You need to be aware of your surroundings because people are killing senselessly. This is hard. In Dallas. I mean, they took a good person life for no reason. I'm Alex Rozier.